Guys, welcome back to another review. This time we're going to be reviewing the uh, dis discontinued Hanway Irish Viking Sword. Um, it has nice, uh, I think that's called a Brazil nut pommel, um, and lashed um, leather straps, and then just a nice short guard. Let me just take it out one second. As you can see, then we have a fairly big fuller along the blade, which runs all the way up to the top of the blade. Alright, let's go outside and test these things. Okay, so we're out here. Um, we've got a few uh, different types of bottles for strength-wise. Um, the first one up here is a very, very uh, weak bottle. And most things should be out, most swords should be able to get through it. Then... I'm going to do a much, much more harder bottle to cut through, which is the bigger one. And then finally, I'm going to see the edge retention test by hitting it up against a wood for a little bit and then seeing how the edge is and dropping through a medium bottle. All right, here we go. Obviously, past that test, that was pretty easy, but most things do. This is a much harder bottle, much harder and thicker plastic. I will be doing a downward spin for this one. Cut through that nicely, like anything. Now, for the third bottle, I'm going to hit this stump that I use with the sword. I'm going to hit it where I usually cut it. Also, this is a good way to test the hilt. No rattle in the hilt, which is great. Alright. Another bottle. It still has perfect edge retention, which means it's a good quality steel. So, there you go. Nice forward, no damage to the blade, kept its edge. So yeah, this was the uh, Hanway Discontinued Viking Sword. Um, subscribe and comment. Hope you like the review. See ya.